So now that you've installed Gravity View, you're ready to create your first view. So from your WordPress admin area, hover over Views here in the left hand menu and click New View. Start by giving your view a name. We'll call this one Customer Profiles. Next you need to select a data source. So this defines where your view pulls its information from. There are two options here. You can either select a form preset or you can select an existing form in Gravity Forms. So as you can see by clicking the Use a Form Preset button, it brings up the list of different preset options. So there's business listings, business data, people profiles, many things to choose from. So basically by, by clicking on one of these, Gravity View will automatically create a form for you in Gravity Forms which will contain all the necessary fields. Gravity View will also automatically configure your view layout to correspond to the preset that you chose. So for example, if we click on People Profiles, Gravity View automatically configures the view layout and you can see there's some widgets at the top here and fields as well have been added. If you're not sure what all, all of this is, don't worry, we cover this in the next video. So let's publish this view. And let's check out our forms in Gravity Forms. And as you can see here, Gravity View has created a new form for us called Gravity View Profiles. We can edit that to have a look. And it's got all the necessary fields for capturing information and then displaying profiles on our website. Okay, so this time let's select an existing form in Gravity Forms. So we'll click on the drop down and select the Contact Us form. As you can see, we're now prompted to choose a view type. There are five different view types in total, but depending on the license that you have, you may only have access to certain ones. So the table and the list layouts come as part of the Gravity View Core license. The data tables layout is available in the Core Plus Extensions license. And the DIY and the map layout are available as part of the All Access license. So to find out more information about each of the view types, check out the article linked below.